I joined Allaire Corporation as actually the very first employee. And at Allaire, I was responsible for invoicing, filing, answering the phone. Uh, and, and I sort of turned that into a position um, running a bunch of the software for the company. I'm Charles Teague. Uh, I'm the CEO and co-founder of uh, Lose It. Um, and Lose It is an application, web application, mobile application that helps consumers lose weight. What I love about what's happened with mobile and the internet um, in the last three to five years is that the ability for users to discover great products has become incredibly easy. What that means is that good products sort of rise to the top. Uh, and so, uh, you know, a world 10 years ago where you could sort of market your way out of a bad product. You know, you could just spend enough money advertising it, spend enough money telling people about it, and you could make a business on that. That world is changing very quickly. Um, you know, at Lose It, um, we, we sort of laugh because we have, a, we have someone who's running our marketing. I give them a budget every year, and it's about $1,000. I go, there, there you go, here's your marketing budget. Enjoy yourselves. You know, I'm sure you can think of a lot of innovative ways to spend $1,000. Um, you know, meanwhile, we've gotten 14 million people who've used the app, um, and we've done that primarily uh, when we survey those users, it's because of word of mouth. It's easy as an entrepreneur working on a problem to have a grand vision for what you think, uh, how you think things ought to work. Um, and it's easy, um, uh, it's, it's easy to think about, to sort of get lost in a vision and stop thinking about the real problems that people have. You have to start with a very concrete user problem. So you have to, you know, the, the user has to feel pain. The user has to be saying, there's something I really want to do that I can't do right now. Uh, and then once you've identified that, you have to ask yourself, I don't think you have to ask yourself, what's the least amount of work you can do? I think you have to ask yourself, what's the least amount of product I can build that will give the user a really great experience? Um, and so it's not about this minimum viable product. It's also not about boiling the ocean. It's about finding the exact right experience and building just to that point. Um, and then I think you have to make sure you have things in place so that you learn from that.